Hey everybody, it's Brian here from quantlabs.net. A friend of mine uh, out of London has introduced me to what I would probably think is the number one charting package I've ever seen. And I've studied lots of them. It's just, uh, I don't know how old this is, but it's pretty impressive. It's called SciChart. Um, and uh, just take a look at some of the clientele they include. Uh, there is Barclays is somewhere in there right here. Uh, JP Morgan, I believe Bloomberg's in here somewhere, uh, and whatever else. But some, there are some big, big banks using this software. So this software is unbelievably good. So if you come to SciChart.com, you'll be able to get access to this uh, demo of what's available in the library. This is using WPF or Silverlight for W, uh, sorry, for .NET. Now, again, if you see my video, why I think Windows is uh, the best out there for trading purposes. This is just another fine example of what you can get in Windows and .NET libraries. So let's get to the really, really cool stuff. Uh, what I want to show you first is a heat map. Now a heat map can be really good uh, in the instance of through MATLAB. Uh, if, if you are uh, watching colors, the red here would typify a um, a typical uh, profit opportunity. Now, again, you'll see this is real time. So that could be profit right under your nose, profit being, uh, profit opportunities coming out of nowhere. So just this alone is worth the money um, for this type of thing. Uh, and if you're able to build a uh, sophisticated MATLAB uh, script um, that I've seen uh, generating these sort of things, uh, with this type of charting capability, you can build some pretty cool stuff. Now, um, you know, you get into scatter plots, uh, but check out how fast uh, this thing can zoom, okay? Uh, it's just, it's it's so unbelievably fast at rendering. Uh, charting, uh, you can see a lot of the charts are meant for trading purposes. Um, so, I'm just, uh, playing around here, but again, um, let me just uh, give you uh, some panning capabilities. You can zoom all the way you want. Now, it's got the usual line charts. Um, it's got, as I said, scatter plots, the, the even, even something like this for um, bubble plots. So maybe this might be good for uh, analyzing from a statistical point of view. Um, but uh, there's some other cool stuff in here that I'm really, really turned on. I haven't gone through all of these, um, but there are some charts specific for um, stock charting. So we get the basic things that you get and expect from a live trading environment. Not only that, let me just show you some of the source code uh, on this. So again, this is just using uh, WPF, let's say. So this is the XAML code that you would provide uh, use. Uh, using with WPF, Windows uh, Presentation Foundation. Um, and these are the sort of things you have the capabilities using this, this library. Not only that, um, it's, it's so unbelievably good, this thing. You can add all your little indicators, your RSI, MACD. Um, you know, you can zoom in as far as you want. And you, you kind of get the idea. It's, it's just, it's, it's pretty cool, all in all. All right, so there's, there's, <coughs> excuse me as I'm sneezing on a video. Ah, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna continue along. But you get the idea, as I said, you get the source code. Boom, 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 boom. I mean, it's, it's pretty straightforward. Uh, but to do this from scratch or some of the other uh, libraries I've seen, this one's pretty good. Um, so this one I'm really, really interested in is the real time ticking start ch stock charts. So in our case, uh, if we do st uh, start real time, you can see it just everything working under your nose, simulated, if, let's say with IQ fee, that, that's pretty cool. Um, and again, you can, you know, zoom in as far as you want. You could, you could have triggers being written around this. And I mean, dude. <laughs> I'm hoping you see the power of this, uh, okay? 
um, but uh, it's very, very, very cool. Again, this is all real time. You can tick once, so you know that's that's your tick data coming in. Um, again, I'm not going to get into. Oh, and you can also get your different types of uh, stocks, stock charting as well. So there you go. Uh, let's see. We did the candle, the the line, uh, the mountain. But you get the idea. Again, here's the source code to be able to provide that. It's pretty cool. It's not a lot. Okay. Um, so what else do we have? Uh, if you're more into uh, the um, math side of things, like I'm learning about logarithmic, um, you know, <laughs> I I don't I don't know what more to say. Um, but there, there is just amazing potential with all this stuff. And also, the other thing is, um, you can do annotations as well. So, you know, uh, I think uh, from what I remember what I was shown, you have the ability to add in your, your uh, what do you call them, the, uh, the lines, your GAN lines and that sort of thing that you can add. Maybe it's one of these, I don't know. But uh, I'm just playing around with this stuff. Now, um, uh, <laughs> I'm just speechless. That's all I can say. All right, so let's talk about pricing. Now, this is the cool part. Uh, there's two editions. There's your Silverlight and your WPF, your, again, Windows Presentation Foundation, depending upon what .NET versions you want. Uh, I think it's US dollars, obviously. Um, so if you're starting out and you just want the WPF, there's I think it's a one-year license for 900 bucks. Um, sounds like a lot, but from what I've seen, uh, you do not get better than this. Um, yeah, for 900 bucks, and it's an annual subscription basically. Or if you want, you can go with the PDF, uh, the Silverlight as well. So overall, uh, very affordable, I would think, for what you get, and something I'm definitely going to look at. And I got to put out major kudos and thanks to the person that uh, introduced this to me. Hopefully, uh, you like what you see. And uh, as always, just come to sidechart.com. Got to give kudos to these guys. These guys are uh, located out of UK, England. Um, so, uh, yeah, they've got something really cool going on. Other than that, uh, hopefully, this will help you out. Talk to you later.